I'm extremely concerned about it. This morning when I went to the, to the office, one car had broken down on the way to Central and the traffic was backed up to the uh, Western Tunnel just by one car. And, and I was getting very worried that I wasn't going to get to my meeting. Now we're talking about 10,000 people occupying a central, which probably means all the roads going into. Uh, and a friend of mine this morning has said, oh, well, if they can't get on the buses, they can go by mass transit. I mean, what a ridiculous thing to say, because you can't get on to mass transit now in the morning because it's so crowded. So how can the people tumble out of the buses and go on the mass transit? It's quite ridiculous to think of that. And those people are going to get very angry. No, I, I don't think it will directly draw a link between uh, that happening and one country, two systems. Uh, people forget this. The two systems are the capitalist system in Hong Kong. And I think the capitalist system will go on. Uh, that is our system. It's clearly defined in, the, in Article 5 of the Basic Law. The capitalist system will endure for 50 years, and I think it will. It won't be changed because of the failure of, the, of, of that um, uh, reform. I've lived here for 57 years now and I've seen and lived through many uh, turbulent times. I remember in 1962 seeing thousands of people walking down over the hills north of our boundary and, and pressing against the wire fence and pulling it down and coming into Hong Kong. And so I've lived through and seen many things happening in Hong Kong. Hong Kong will endure. It'll endure for 50 years and beyond 50 years.